Another showy shade grass we have is Japanese blood grass, Imperata cylindrica. And there's a number of cultivars with uh, red foliage like this. This one's called Red Baron. And I'm presenting this plant as something to use very cautiously in the landscape. The uh, wild type of Japanese blood grass is all green and it is considered a noxious weed by the US government and is not allowed to be sold on the market. A number of red cultivars are uh, available for sale and you can plant these in the landscape and they're not as aggressive as the wild type, the all green. However, sometimes they can revert back to the all green form and you might find some completely green stems coming up and that's when the plant becomes a problem. It can spread very aggressively and it'll also produce seed. So if you do plant uh, Japanese blood grass in the landscape, if you ever notice uh, the green, uh, the reversion to the green form, you want to remove it from the landscape um, and destroy it. Uh, it's a grass that I would use very cautiously. It certainly has a unique, beautiful coloration, uh, but we might try to find that color elsewhere.